Hello everyone, welcome back and what I'll be talking today is do you struggle to see your own growth? So, so many people have hard time understanding how their own growth looks like and they also undermine the little things which I think when I'm working with my clients are so very important. So I'll be talking about some things which would be kind of a self-reflection and you can check with yourself that if you're doing all those things, so believe me when I say that, then you're growing in life. And once you start growing in your life, you will also start basically succeeding in whatever you're trying to achieve. So as you all know, in this channel, I talk a lot about power of mind, mind and uh, mindsets, emotional intelligence, NLP and I share the tools with you all so that you can also apply it in your life right away and start to see the results. And uh, before I do that, please do press the bell icon uh, and of course press the like button. And of course you can share this video, you know, with somebody who can get some benefit out of it. And last but not the least, please do subscribe to my channel. And with that, let's get started. So I want you to think today in this video that have you grown in your life or not? Or are you seeing any signs of growth in your life or not? So I'm, I'm going to be very specific. If you see any of these signs, that means you're growing in your life. Okay, so let's get started on that. So what is personal growth and a success mindset looks like and highlighting the importance of these two areas is so very important in your journey, whatever you're trying to achieve. So number one is have you start noticing about yourself that you're not getting mad anymore at little stuff? So that's a very good sign that you're growing mentally and you're starting to see the things in a, from a different perspective that where you have to spend time and where you don't have to spend time. So you're already growing in that. So what is number two? You don't waste time on the toxic people. Like this is my personal favorite because I realized it a few years back because there are some people in your life, whether it's your personal life or your professional life, they would try to get off of your track, whatever you're trying to do. And they do it very subtly sometimes, you know, they might not be saying it on your face, but they, oh, what are you doing? Just trying to waste your time or something. You really need to learn that who are the toxic people and how they are influencing you and how you can get rid of them for once and for all. So this is a very important thing you need to learn. And if you are doing it, and like right now I am, so I'm growing in somewhere, okay? In my life or my in my business. So sign number three, you don't need anything you go with the flow of life. Now what does that mean? So right now, uh, like if I talk about my personal self, I don't need anything from anybody in a way. I just do have a team, I do have people who work for me, but literally uh, about knowing what the coaching industry and the world is, I might need a little help over there. So I exactly know what I'm trying to do. So that's a good sign. That means I've grown over the years. So if you have met me seven, eight years back, I had, would have no clue to give it to you, like what I'm getting into and what is happening. But now I can. So this is the difference. So you've already grown so much. Okay. So if you think that the first response of yours for any situation is not grabbing somebody or getting hold of somebody for anything. So you have grown pretty much. So what is this, uh, the key or the step number four you feel that you're growing in that in your life? You have a positive mindset that everything is always working out. For me, it's more for a more so for, I would say positive, it's a very assertive mindset. It's a both, it's a balance, right? So I'm always thinking, yes, it's going to work out for me, but yes, if I need to improve on something, definitely I have to do it differently, right? So the perspective changes a lot. And, but the best part about it is that yes, it is going to work out for me. So that is the bottom line, which you have to reprogram your mind to. Yes, it's going to work out, whether it's this way or that way. I don't know how, but I'll work towards it, but it's going to work out. 
and the important part is don't leave the working or the action part you know you have to take your own actions according to whatever you're trying to do and the last one the sign or the step or the key is no longer looking for validation for people yes that is a huge one so you no longer asking people is it good is it bad you just know it you're doing it for some reason and you know the reason very well you have a perfect clarity of it all right so i hope those five signs keys or steps were very important and you can check yourself right now how much you have grown from previous year past five years or 10 years you can check it all away all right i hope that is helpful to you all i'll be back again with next video and you all have a wonderful day thanks for watching